On a stretch of land, 40% of the area is orchard, and the remaining 60% is meadow. So we can try to draw that down below here. We have a piece of land. We have orchard. We have meadow. And this is going to be 40%, which means this should be about 60%. Next, they tell us that there are buildings on exactly 22.5% of the orchard. So if we try to break this down, remember to divide by 100. So we have 0.225 has buildings, which would mean 1 minus 0.225 or 0.775 doesn't have buildings. <clears throat> they also tell us that buildings on 15.5% of the meadow. So same thing, we can do 0.155 has buildings which means 1 minus 0.155 or 0.845 does not have buildings. Finally, they say that 30% of the land that is free of buildings, so that's going to be these two, so 30% of this is going to be something, uh, both in the orchard and the meadow contains a particular species of flowers. So we can calculate that right now. We want to be careful here, so we need to start all the way back at 40% of our land is meadow, or is orchard, and then times 0.775, because that's what doesn't have buildings, and then times 0.3, because that's the part of the non-building land in the orchard that has flowers. So if we do that, 0.4 times 0.775 times 0.3, I'm getting, where can I fit this, point? 0.93 for that side. And for the left side, I'm getting 0.6 times 0.845 times 0.3. So that's going to be 0.6 times 0.845 times 0.3. I'm getting 0.1521. And if I just add that to 0.093, my final answer here, I'll write it up above, is, and this is a trick, it's not 24, it's not 0 0.2451. They want it Q percent. They want it back into percentage form. So my final answer here is actually going to be 24.51%, but you would just enter that.